kilala, check him out. But thank you very much for joining <laughs> us here on the Filipinas Live app, on Filipinas Live Online, and of course on PBA Rush. Coach, ito Magnolia team, as you see Jed Mendoza attacking and scoring the first point. Kapila naman, Coach, offensively, Northport have, have really lit up the scoreboards every time they play. That Lapos goes hard inside and finishes underneath. What have Northport been doing right so far? Because guys like Arvin Tolentino have been popping here for Coach Bonita. What have they been doing right? Playing well together. Number two, Boyd. By the confidence because of uh, seeing action in the All-Star Weekend in Bacolod, that also adds up. Yes. So you show what you have in practices and you will be rewarded with extensive and extended floor time. So hard on the double there to get the ball out of Arvin Tolentino's hands. As Rosales in the corner. <laughs> Baroka. Did you see? And That's Munzon. the best pick packet in town right now. Joshua Munzon. Coming in like a thief in the night. <laughs> exactly, pun intended. And uh, not, too many, not too many players can do that to Mars Maroka, really. That's the second game, coach. Because thief in the afternoon doesn't work up a half of the Paul Lee pulls that for three. Oh, he needed that, coach. Let's take a look at that again. That first sequence, there's that first steal. In the back tip. What, what about the perfect forward pass? First pass is on. And here, Paul Lee getting that three-pointer. Gio Halalo. Now Paul Lee in the zone. Oh, tough. Tough look, but it doesn't matter for Paul Lee, who makes it look easy. And of course, Coach, an upset stomach. It's nothing to slough about because he'll feel weak. <laughs> and Very of weak. course, uh, Tolentino unable to finish there. But of course, Coach, the, the only one way to get rid of an upset stomach is to eat ng masaya para hindi siya upset. As Mendoza attacks and scores inside. In college and uh, pure foods, uh, today tricks you. Well, at least baby faced. Hi, baby Sobra. faced Zamar. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. Si Daddy or si. Uh, Both of them. <laughs> As right now, Northport are getting to work inside. They've uh, shot well from outside, but Zeb Lucero. 56 points inside the frame. Attacking, dishing, making it easier to score against a very sound defensive unit. Nice to see him once again up and about after that PCL injury. Aguayba swinging around, Ian Sangalang, he always finishes with his left coach. It's a pretty big combination for Magnolia. He's trying the match up with Tolentino at the free spot. Oh, what a find inside, Ian Sangalang. Right way, nararamdaman. You have to play through it. Yeah. And sometimes it catches up with you. There was the Gila's duty for the World Cup and the Asian Games, plus a long run to Frangai Ginebra. Scored heavily when he played for the Fighting Maroons of UP. Reclaimed the championship after a long while, two years back, knocking in his first three ball. Now Paraiso finding Flores, he gets it back. Paraiso said, okay, Whoa. I'm going to shoot, and he scores! And uh, this zone defense has contained that early first quarter explosion for Magnolia that gave them a double-digit lead. Oh, and the Northport Batam Pierre have found the range from beyond the arc. Being a bit hurt here, Mark Baroka, his uh, shooting arm has a bit of an issue. Here's Paul Zamar. He hit one three a while ago. Now he has two. From it all the way. Former teammates, huh? And pangabut ba? Oh, Lucero. Managing to find a way to score inside. It has been an impressive few minutes here for Northport Batantier. Take a look at Bulanadi finding Lucero and Lucero able to bury that two. zone. Bolli driving, attacking, beating Baroca, but what a block there. That's the number one shot blocker right now. Lucero finishes up close. Yeah, that is also the same narrative as uh, George Brook or Isaac Brook. Yes, that's also true. This photo scores inside. Eight defense shown here. But that's what you expect if you wear a Magnolia shirt. Players are just down defensively. Valentino attacking, trying to get in between two scores and one. Overpower the last line defender. And then the man yung help. Eh. Well, he had the size advantage. And it's a different look here for Northport defensively. Calvin Abueva. Able to catch that ahead of Lucero oh. and what a finish from Abueva. That's your best uh, rest break finisher, really. Navarro attacks Lapot. Oh, 
I do it look. away. And those are signs of youth, coach. Right. And here, Navarro, fouled by Gio Lalo. No, they struggling offensively. That's been a theme of their conference so far. Baroja thought about it. Great find inside, but even a better block. J.M. Calma trying to get... Oh, Arvin Tolentino with the erasure. Mark Baroja. Eight-point lead still. Mahanmisi brings That's, it down. That is what they're looking for. Back-to-back -back triples from uh, Chris Rosales. Correct. Who scored the first six points here at Northport. As Eddie Yobu answers with three of his own. Last time that this team won against TNT. That's going to be one of the things that he needs to work on in his career as Laport scores and one. You may have it maybe two games in a row, but to stay consistent throughout the whole Yan talaga yung challenge. As the timeout's called on the floor here. 41-39 is the count in favor of Northport. We'll be right back in. Now a 19-16 scoring quarter. Still in favor of Northport though. Nakabalik na. With this unit. And here's Han Misi. He hit 1-3 now. He has two. Adamos. Hey, man to man D here talking about Magnolia. Oh, and what a... Baroka. Ending up Weva inside, and he manages to flip that in. Big two-way pressure for Calvin of Weva. Fueling this second quarter rally. We're racing an eight-point deficit and restoring a two-point lead. Colentino up top. Malakasa na katawan, eh, no? Baraga. In that type of ball game, yes. Flores from deep gets that to go. That's an add on value for Kate Flores. 45 44, the lead swings <laughs> back to Northport. On Misi, now Baroka. Baroka struggling with his own shooting, hands it off to Ryobu. Offensive rebounding of Magnolia stopped them big time. And Lapo with a big bucket. Right. For Ian Sangalang. Valentino finding Lucero inside. Good ball movement. Doesn't go anywhere though. Oh, Torres shot, forces shot. the shot, gets that to fall. Was not a willing taker of that last shot. But with shot clock winding down, finding the way to kiss that ball off the glass. Well, he made it anyway, and that's what matters to Flores exactly. at Northport. Sangalang again had 10 points at the start of the quarter. And wow. now with 16. Six uh, points for Ian Sangalang, unstoppable here in quarter number three. Lucero might be the best matchup to Ian Sangalang. But right now, Sangalang has scored six straight points in the first minute and 30 of the third. Once again, attacking the pace, something that Magdoli was not able to do in their last loss versus the Index Road Warriors. Lucero, oh, oh, what a two-on-two -two break here. Flores unable to collect, and Abueva runs. Abueva attacks, and Abueva turns it over. Chris Rosales now working on Paul Lee. Rosales cannot finish. Lucero does. And then the press once again coming from Northport after free throws. Now remember, Northport actually did a great job uh, just playing with the zone a while ago. But then here is Ian Sangalang again with his eighth point in the quarter. It was a conscious effort on the part of Magnolia really to get him the basket more deep and close to the rim. Now playing with two bigs here. Lapo. Like that again. Jose Lucero. Now to Tolentino, can he get going here? Yes, he can. That's a big triple there. Paraiso. Navarro. So he finds a calma. Now to Paraiso. He'll try a three and get a three. Soto. Now to Halalo. Not to top. Paraiso trying to stay with him. They get the switch here. Mismatch. And now Baroja left wide open. Gio Halalo. Four point lead here for Magnolia in the third quarter. Finding Lapos inside, goes up. Perfect bounce pass coming from Gio Halalon. Knifing his way inside, locating Lapos underneath. Well, all of a sudden, though, we were praising Northport's zone a while ago. Now there are trouble in the first half. In the first half, there's now it's been a trouble here for them, unable to stop anything inside. It's brand new. It's this type of place. Earlier coming from Halala, but what about you? Off the bench, scoring once again. Stopping up Weva right in front of him. Brand new. Pulls up for three. Oh, that's a confident shot for Brand new. 
Believe from way downtown, no good. Now Baroka to Ahan Misi. Finally! The way that he is actually forcing turnovers don't actually result in steals for himself. He only has one registered steal as he and Sangalang finishes the break. Valentino, the turnaround. Jay gets that a ball. That was a pretty look there from Marvin Valentino. Anisi on the drive. Oh, and what a block by Lucero. And off to the races, Munzon with the finish. Perfect sequence. Big defensive play by Lucero really after that escape pack by Anisi. And again, unselfish ways here for Batampier. The young legs there of Batampier on the move. Ah, Anisi could not strike back with three. Zamar attacking Barroca, sails in for two. Well, yes. Has a look here. So, yeah, first the block by the center. Yeah. Yes. A block that fuels a transition play. And they will go back to back transition baskets. One point lead here for Magnolia. And Avanoveva hit the deck here. One man advantage here for Northport. And Lucero takes advantage. Basket end one will have a chance to get the bonus. But they were down one by uh, by a man as Abreu did not go down to play defense. This best move of the game is brought to you by Honda, the official motorcycle of the PBA. Uh, a 12 of 23. It might haunt them late in the match. Mark Baroca gets free of Flores, finding in Sangalang inside. Fuller line up here meanwhile for bottom here. Lucero will have his hands full trying to contain in Sangalang. Paul Lee trying to get away in the curl. Great find of Cueva. And Sangalang with a finish. That's a mistake defensively on the hedge that opened up Sangalang underneath. Sangalang unstoppable almost during the 30 point mark. Oh, almost dropped the handle talking about Fran Yu. And eventually will get an inbound instead. Then Mendoza. Now to Mark Paroca. Paroca working on Munzon. Almost a oh. turnover there. Baroja gets free and the finishes. Munson gambled, went for another back tip. Was successful in the first two quarters against Baroja. Not that in that last sequence. Baroja, five in the match. Valentino. Oh, the sidestep three. Munson gets a big three. Improved offense. Defense uh, in terms of finishing their opponents under 90. Almost about to be breached. Mark Baroca left open after the gamble from Munzon. It looks like their next practice, regardless of the result, coach, uh, a few players will stay and extra, shoot. Uh, yeah, shoot extra, extra free throws. throws. Ahan Misi left open for three. And that's how you attack the zone. Baroca. Now Escoto. No good, wide open jumper, Mark Baroja. Another offensive rebound for Magnolia. And what a fall from Escoto, pero wala pa rin. A third opportunity in Ian Sangalang. A three here could turn into a one possession ball game. And that has been their biggest weapon this game so far. Talk about Northport. Fran Yu, driving, attacking. What a block from Ian Sangalang, but Fran Yu stays alive. Northport. Let's take a look at that again, coach. Block, recovered. Fran Yu has it, Fran Yu pull up three straight away, and oh, Fran Yu keeps Northport alive. Wow. Tolentino was a decoy, and Fran Yu right at the face of Mark Barroca. Cut here from Paul Lee, Paul Lee. Now to Mark Barroca. Barroca gets free off the push and gets a big bucket to go. Take a look at this again, driving at Fran Yu, and just using his strength to get rid of Fran Yu. A game on the line. Flores will try to help out the cushion, and that won't work out. 104-97 is the final count here in an entertaining one between Magnolia and Northport.